Well, just like I was saying on stage, when we first started doing metal, there was no movement like Afropunk. And like I said, we hadn't played together for six years. And, uh, you know, I called the guys. I was like, yo, there's this movement going on in Brooklyn. We got to go. And uh, so Afropunk to me means that, you know, there's um, breaking stereotypes and there's so much expansion because, you know, music is a language. It shouldn't be owned by any group of people that, you know, anybody should be able to speak a language if they're willing to learn it. And so we just wanted to come here and support the movement in all honesty. And uh, do you have any, like, do you have any words of wisdom for young girls who want to get into heavy music, into playing heavy music? Just do it. It's my words of wisdom. Just freaking do it. Like we saw on Lacking the Truth up there, you know, it's like you saw 12 year old boys from Brooklyn just Smashing. rocking out. <laughs> Straight smash. Do it. Do yeah. what you love. Do what you love. Do yep. what you love. Always. If you don't love it, don't do it. Yep. It doesn't make sense. You know? Yo, what's up, Afro Punk? This is Wicked Wilson bringing it to you heavy and grimy on the Yo. East Coast, baby. Love you. Yeah. Yes, sir. Bringing that darkness. That's right. <laughs> Real chocolate for you. Yeah. All up in that Bella, yeah! Be in the city near you. We ain't going nowhere. Yep. We just went and hiding for a little while. Wonderful. 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 Wonder